are about to go do a little shop with me and hopefully not get kicked out. That's so cute, so cute, so cute. Hey guys, and welcome back to the vlog. Good morning. I have not vlogged in a while and I miss like having those memories. So I figured we could vlog a little bit today and we'll see how it goes. You guys have really been loving my home decor content, which is awesome. And I wanna keep doing a lot of that, but I love vlogging too. So I wanna vlog a little bit so you guys remain like in the know about my life and I can keep all these memories because that's like my favorite part about vlogging. It's October 10th and we are about to go downtown. What's the matter? Oh, hello. Hi. Hi, Pooh. <laughs> so my best friend Erica, who you guys are probably familiar with, is here and we're about to go take some pictures. Fun fact, my little, I, one of my many little side hustles was that I manage social media for like small businesses. She sells shirts. Her name is the Threadbare Gypsy, so I'll leave her link down below. Um, like Disney shirts. So we're gonna go model some of her shirts today and take some pictures for her. So it's gonna be really fun. So let's go. is the fact that we have to change our clothes in the car. We've been doing this all day. So, it's been a fun Instagram. time. Instagram yeah. life. Instagram life. So when you see somebody who takes a lot of Instagram pictures and everybody, and they look all cute, think about the fact that they probably did like a huge day where they shot all of that stuff, yeah. and they're changing in the car or like behind a tree. <laughs> my dryer is broken which sucks <laughs> I had to go out and buy a clothesline and clothespins because I don't want to try to figure out how to fix it and Tim doesn't come home for another two weeks so things are going great around here do you know how hard it is to find a clothesline in this day and age it's hard I had to check multiple places so we're home right now we're about to head back out to town in a little bit I want to take you guys with us because are you buckled in, Kay? No, mom, see the comment, and then you can get one when you eat, okay? For some reason, getting kids in the car is just like so hard. So hard. To get from the door to the car is like the most difficult part of my day. My life eating. You got this, girl. Come on, girl, you can do it. Oh, oh, oh. Yay! Take a bite. Take a bite. Take a bite. <laughs> So we are now outside of Hobby Lobby and Home Goods. We are about to go do a little shop with me and hopefully not get kicked out because that's my biggest fear when I shop, do a shop with me is that I'm gonna get kicked out of a store for filming because that happened to me one time. But we're about to go do a shop with me in Hobby Lobby, show you guys some of the Christmas decorations that they have in Hobby Lobby because I love Christmas more than anything. So let's go. So we're in the um, wall decor section, which is currently 50% off. As you guys know, um, Hobby Lobby is great about putting their stuff on sale. I really would like to have something for above my bed, but I want like a cutout word and not like a picture. So I haven't really found anything that I want just yet. I've been biding my time, but we're just currently looking over here, even though we're supposed to be here looking at Christmas. Uh, we'll go look at that in a minute. But. Cow. <laughs> Oh, those tear trays are nice. So Christmas decor is 40% off and these are so cute. They would look so cute on a little tear tray. Hey, <laughs> they'd look so cute on a little tear tray. 
Oh, and they have green ones too. Like, look at how cute those are. I'm dead. They are $2.99 and 40% off. So, not a bad gig. Oh, okay. We're doing it. <laughs> there you have some um, of these mats. Super cute. And then this is really cute. Love that. So I really love nativity sets. I really love this one because kids always mess with nativity sets as it is. And like something like this would get broken. But this is perfect for a kid. It's so cute. It is. This one is $49.99 and 40% off. But it's so, so cute. I love this. So I haven't really decided on like a theme for my Christmas decor yet, but I just want to share some of the cute things that we find here today. I just think that it would be fun to show you guys some stuff in Hobby Lobby that I'm loving and that I'm thinking about getting. I can't actually go get anything until I like break out everything that I have because I don't know all that I have because after Christmas every year I buy stuff. I don't really remember everything that I have. So I need to break it all out, check it out and see what we have and see how it's going to work in the new house before I buy anything. But I just want to share some stuff that I think is really cute. I know it's early for Christmas stuff but if you're like me you plan your decorations ahead of time and if not maybe this will just give you some ideas because Hobby Lobby's had their Christmas stuff out forever y'all so just just a heads up I know some people don't like to hear about Christmas but this will be a fun video to just show you guys what they have y'all look at this tree it is so tall so big. 12 foot like it would, not fit in our house. it would not fit in our house you're right 40% off it's 40% off so this one I love, this nine foot flocked tree. And it's 419, super cute, already pre-lit. That one's nice too. So I love to do a kitchen tree and I love things like this for the kitchen tree, like little candy ornaments. Like that's so cute. This one is super adorable, like a little camper. Love it. And this one is also really cute. <laughs> coffee ones this one's cute i love ones that look like little foods i just think they're adorable like this one that one's super cute too i love these little trees like these are so cute i probably wouldn't pay as much for them as they're asking because i think that they're asking 129 for this one and 99 for this one because i know walmart has ones that are like a set of three trees that aren't that expensive but i do love the look of these i think they're so cute like just for like an entryway or something so I really love the things like this to go on Christmas trees. I think they're so cute. This one's really cute too. Um, they are $14.99, 40% off. I just love them. I just think they're so fun and cute. I'm also really loving these garlands. I just think they're so traditional and cute. Like we used to make these when I was a kid. So I just love that. All of these are actually really cute and like just so different for a garland. Here's some over here also. Um, these ones are like white, which I love with gold in them. I love these beads. And these are like a little bit rustic, but could also be like a little bit boho for Christmas. And I just think they are adorable. They're $7.99 and 40% off. They're in this whole like buffalo check line over here. So they also have this hot cocoa line and it is so cute i love this cocoa bar sign i think this would be so cute on like a little coffee bar these little things these little gingerbread houses like look at this little thing it says toppings and then there's this here it says made with love so these little things are super cute too um they are magnets but i think they would look really cute on like a tiered tray also just like stuck in the corner somewhere so these bowls are so cute better not pout Ho ho ho, very adorable. I love them. There's even little ho 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 cup of joe. I really love this. Look, I'll tell y'all what. Christmas decorations gives me some kind of joy, like better than seeing your food coming in a restaurant. Nothing in the world is better than Christmas decorations. Okay, would like these fa la 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 llama. <laughs> All of these things, like even little Christmas scrubbing sponges. And this vinyl tablecloth is so cute. Love that. What is this? Oh, a cake scraper? Cute. Cookies for Santa. So I don't know that I would use a lot of this Grinch stuff, but I think it's so cute. I just would love to decorate the playroom with it. I think it'd be so cute and fun to have like Grinch and like all of this really whimsical type stuff in a playroom. 
this is cute Kay would love that it's a little llama and then all of this stuff is so adorable as well love it like look at these little um, National Lampoon's Christmas vacation quotes that's super funny I also really love this like cutout words I love cutout words and it says Merry Christmas so down this aisle we have like rustic decor and I love this love that like this is so cute with the little beads I also really like this one this one and all these little ones are so cute too can't go wrong with those right big fan so Hobby Lobby's about to close and we don't have much time left, but I do love this. That's super cute. I love all this white stuff. I love like white and green Christmas decor. So this is like right up my alley. Like this is my favorite aisle. This is super cute. It's like a little advent calendar. And all of this, like these buffalo checks are really cute too. I like the green ones better though, I'll be honest with you. <sighs> Nothing makes me happier than Christmas. Like love this, so cute. All of this stuff. I really like this too, Christmas bucket list. That's adorable. This is really adorable. Both of these are. We seem to have lost Erica somewhere in this store. Those are cute. Everything's cute. I'm gonna stand here and tell y'all that everything in this store is cute and then you guys are gonna be like, so what do you actually like? It's gonna be everything, love everything. Oh, I love these. You guys know that I love Snoopy so much. Those are so adorable and we have a little flag this year. So I love those. Probably gonna have to get one of those. Stockings were hung by the chimney with care. So last year I think we had white stockings, burlap stockings, I don't remember. I'll have to see, but lots of cute stockings this year. This is cute. I would've got that last year because we had just gotten married. But we'll see. I haven't picked out my stocking theme yet this year, but they're super cute. I do like to have them all go together. So that's always kind of an issue for the kids because they want like this one. And I'm like, nah, fam, that's not happening. Lots of cookie jars. So cute. Definitely gonna have to get a cookie jar this year because I don't think that we have one. I love this little truck one. I have a truck one for Halloween too. And I love that little gingerbread house one. What's that? I would like this. And I would like this. Tim, and you would like that? Yeah, why? Because I like Pokemon I have tons of them. Yeah. Little Olaf down there, that's so cute. That guy's cute too with the little marshmallow. So needless to say, there's like so much stuff in Hobby Lobby that I would die for and probably will buy. But like I said, I need to put everything out that I have to see like what I need. But I just thought it'd be fun to show you guys like what they had in there and what I was loving and what I was thinking about. But we're about to head into Home Goods too. So we're gonna just show you guys random stuff in Home Goods because I don't know how much Christmas stuff they have, but I do know they have a lot of like cute stuff. So let's go to Home Goods. You guys know I have some Ray done, but it's just so funny now that like the Ray done is everywhere you can pretty much buy it wherever you want these ones are always pretty cute but I never buy the ones that have like the characters on them I only buy the ones that are the large letter I don't really buy any of them anymore Callie wants there to be toys so she's searching for toys and this is how we get stuck in the toy section of every store we go to. Oh, I have a lot of these baskets in the girls' rooms. I really like them and they're super inexpensive here. Like $5.99 per basket. Sometimes you can find the smaller ones for $5.99 for two. This so this is really cute. We're tra doing travel theme for the girls' room and I love that. Show me your dance. a nice dance boo <laughs> I really love this for the kids playroom too so cute I love world maps and stuff I think they're freaking adorable these would be cute too like there's a bunch of them I think those would be cute in their travel themed room as well so they got tons of cute like super Halloween what? stuff in here love this little witch how cute it just sucks because they don't really put their Halloween stuff on clearance ever so it's not like you can get it at a discounted price. So they do have a couple Christmas things in here. I think this guy's really cute so far. And this is cute. And I love little gnomes too, so this guy's pretty cute. Let's see how much he is. How much is him? $19.99. Not bad, he's really heavy. 
He could definitely be an outside gnome. And then there's a bigger one too. Not much Christmas yet in yeah. here, but still super cute. Okay guys, so I forgot to end the vlog yesterday, which pretty much happens to me every time I do a vlog. I just forget to end the dang thing and I don't know why, but anyway, I'm here to end the vlog. And I'll tell you that I hope you guys enjoyed my little shop with me. I didn't get kicked out of Hobby Lobby or Home Goods, so that's a plus. I've been terrified ever since they told me I couldn't vlog in AC Moore one time to ever take my camera out inside another store ever. But I, it, it, it's okay, I got over my fear, I guess. So maybe we'll do more shop with me. So let me know down below. If you liked it and you would like to see more, I would like to do more. I think they're fun, especially the Christmas ones. I think they're like fun to show you guys like, what's in the store. I do a lot of that on my Instagram, so make sure you follow me there. Can we talk about how many times I said cute in this vlog? Because while I was editing it, I was like, oh my God, if I don't shut up saying cute. So if that was annoying, sorry. You probably wouldn't like hanging out with me in Hobby Lobby in general because I say cute like 800 times, even if I'm not vlogging, but that was bad. So if you counted how many times I said cute and you put it down below, I'll, I don't know what I'll do, but that'll be really impressive. So sorry. I said that word a lot. <laughs> I know that it's before Thanksgiving and before Halloween and we're talking about Christmas, but y'all, I couldn't help myself. I was excited. I'm still excited. I love Christmas. I love the holidays and I like to plan so my holiday decor looks really like good and I'm just excited to decorate this house this year, as you can tell. If you don't like Christmas and you're still here watching this video at this point, um, I'm sorry for you. And if you don't want to hear about it, I'm sorry for you. Let people enjoy things. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Uh, I like Christmas decorations. Anyway, I'm gonna end this and I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Make sure to subscribe if you're not. Make sure to follow me on Instagram. Follow Erica on Instagram. And yeah, that's it for today. Bye! No, I can't wait for the weekend. Waking up next to you. We'll be sharing our secrets. Making dreams come true. Have a toast for the